this week, we'll be highlighting some great local events during the first week of December. To begin, we have four events on our roster for Sunday, December 1st. The first event will take place at Blue Heron Park Nature Center. The Family Nature Crafts event is geared towards small children and their caregivers. Park Rangers will host this free program in which families design their own artwork that is nature themed. Past themes have included eco-friendly projects and beach exploration. Family Nature Crafts will begin at 11 a.m. and supplies are provided. During the same time slot, you'll also have the option to browse the works of accomplished crafters at the annual juried Holiday Arts and Crafts Fair. On the sprawling lawn of the Alice Austin House, this will be the second part of this two-day event that features local vendors selling handmade herbs and spices, holiday art, apparel, and more. From 11 a.m. to 5 p.m., visit area vendors and help support local business. There will be a prize raffle and refreshments provided as well. Also taking place on December 1st will be a Christmas fair at Moore Catholic High School. This event is open to the public and will include a holiday raffle and local vendors, and there will also be a game of white elephant for attendees. This event will take place from 11 a.m. until 5 p.m. If you'd like more information about the Christmas fair, please contact Sabrina Panfilo at 718-606-7122. The final event on Sunday, December 1st will be of interest to young scientists. The Under the Spotlight Microscope Investigations Conifers and Cones program will allow children ages eight and up to examine evergreen pine needles and cones they collect in the forest. After their foray through nature, participants will return to the educational building to examine their specimens under microscopes. This educational activity is sponsored by Councilman Vincent Ignacio and lab equipment is provided by the Northfield Foundation. Meet up at the Nevada Avenue entrance to High Rock Park at 1 p.m. and be sure to register ahead of time by calling 718-351-3450 or email naturecenter at sigreenbelt.org. The following Friday, December 6th, a holiday celebration will be held at the Conference House. Sing Christmas carols and enjoy complimentary hot cider and cookies by candlelight. The annual Grand Illumination will take place at 7 p.m. Be sure to dress warmly for this outdoor event. Also, December 6th will be the kickoff day for Snug Harbor's Veterans Memorial Hall production of It's a Wonderful Life, a live radio play running through December 22nd. Thursday, Friday, and Saturday showings will be performed just like an old radio broadcast before a live studio audience. Come see this American classic at 8 p.m. or attend a Sunday matinee at 2 p.m. Tickets cost between $35 and $40. Students and seniors are eligible for a $5 discount. Purchase your ticket at hltc.org or by calling 866-811-4111. Lastly, we have three events to present that take place on Saturday, December 7th. The first event will be another festival at Moore Catholic High School. The Christmas Carnival is sure to be a joyful holiday event for children and their families. Kids can get their photo taken with Santa himself, and there will even be a magic show. Breakfast is also provided. This event runs from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Please call 718-606-7122 if you'd like more information about the Christmas Carnival. On Saturday, December 7th, Artist Melissa Casciola will be holding an artist talk at the Alice Austin House. Miss Casciola has created an exhibit called War and Peace using tintype photographs. Arrive at 2 p.m. to receive a one-hour gallery tour and learn more about tintype photography. There is no cost to attend this artist talk. The last event we have on December 7th will be called Island Originals, Holiday Stars of Original Music and Art. Well-known musical artists in the Staten Island community such as Queen Tipsy and Joan Cadell and the Midnight Choir will perform at a holiday party at the St. George Theater. Holiday art will also be on sale. Doors open at 6.30 p.m. and the show begins at 8 p.m.